Today we're going to go through and show you how to change the default email set up on your iPhone. I'm also going to show you how to do the browser as well because they're very similar. So what this will basically be is if you ever share anything or if you ever get shared anything and you need to open up your browser or an email to send, it will use these clients from now on to go ahead and open them. So you won't have to be stuck with the mail app. You can use whatever has had the correct update for this to work. A few things, you do have to have iOS 14 and you want to make sure your apps are currently updated all the way because this is relatively new if you're just watching it so it's going to take a little bit of time for some of the apps to get updated but from what i have seen so far most of them have already been taken care of at least the major ones welcome everybody i'm kevin with helpfultutorials.net if you like iphone tips tricks and tutorials do me a favor go ahead and smack that subscribe button we would love to have you join us and with that said, let's go ahead and dive right in and show you what we're talking about here. So if I want to go ahead and have it, so anytime I share something or I get shared, it opens up in a different browser. We'll start with the browser and then we'll do the email after. First, you want to pick which browser you're going to want and you're going to have to have it downloaded. I use Brave. I've told you guys before, Brave's an awesome browser and you even make money with it. Yes, it's legit. I've cashed out hundreds of dollars from them. So if you're interested in that, I'll put the link up top. It's definitely, it's very safe. It's like Google Chrome. So if you like Google Chrome, you'll like that. So with that, we want to go ahead and link Brave to it. You don't do it within the Brave app though. You actually do it within the settings, which makes sense. And you'll do this the same way if you're doing it with Google Chrome or any other browser that you like. So what you want to do is tap on settings and then you want to scroll down and you want to keep on scrolling, 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 and then you want to get to where Brave is. So there's Brave. I'll go ahead and tap on that. And it says default browser app. So currently it is Safari because it's always been that. There was no way of changing this before iOS 14. So with iOS 14, this is now available. Took 14 versions to get it, but we got it. So we're gonna click on that and we'll see which browsers that we have installed here. We have Brave, so we'll go ahead and choose Brave. And now it'll open up in a nice, crisp, clean, great looking Brave window. <laughs> Just looks so much nicer than Safari. Sorry, Safari, you're good, but uh, Brave's better. <laughs> so that is how we go ahead and set up the default browser, but I know you're here for the email, so let's go ahead and do that real quick as well. We're gonna go ahead and scroll down to our email, which we're gonna do it for Gmail. So we're gonna go look for Gmail. There we are. And let's go ahead and tap on Gmail. And you probably already figured this out, but if you haven't, you're going to go ahead and tap on default mail app. And then it shows you uh, Gmail or mail. So now we go ahead and choose Gmail and we are all set. I'm going to show you exactly how this works too. So make sure you stay here with us. Now, if we go back, we're going to be set up for all Gmail. Okay, so here's an example. I have a link from the website helpfultutorials.net. Heard it's a good website. <laughs> I might be a little biased. Let's go ahead and tap on it and see what happens here. And boom, it opens it up in Brave right away. It takes me right to the article and talks about this blog post, which is how to enable your iPhone to read NFC tags. And it's in the nice Brave. You don't have to worry about the Safari which is really nice and I like it. So it's gonna automatically open into there. So we have no worries about it going through an opening in Safari and that's how it works. So I really hope this helped. Thank you so much for the view and here are some other videos I think you'll enjoy.